In the movie Fight Club, Brad Pitt's character explains how they discovered soap. He said, and I quote, Ancient peoples found their clothes got cleaner if they washed them at a certain spot in the river. Why? Because human sacrifices were once made on the hills above the river. Year after year, bodies burnt, rain fell, water seeped through the wood ashes to become lye. The lye combined with the melted fat of the bodies till a thick white soapy discharge crept into the river. So they were onto something. But in order to understand how they clean, we need to understand its production. Let's firstly look at triglycerides, which is a general name given to a compound made from three molecules of fatty acid joined to a glycerol molecule. Firstly, fatty acids are long hydrocarbons with a carboxylic functional group. Glycerol is known as a triple alcohol because it contains one, two, three hydroxy functional groups. Its systematic name is propentriol, or its preferred IUPAC name is propane-1,2,3-triol try because of the three hydroxyl functional groups. Since triglycerides are fatty acids joined to glycerol, let's do it. Here's our glycerol again. We'll bring in a typical fatty acid, which is essentially a long carboxylic acid, and join them together at their functional group, which releases water as a result. Reaction requires three, so we'll attach the other two, which release another two water molecules. This reaction looks familiar. Do you see it? Glycerol, which is an alkanol, reacts with three fatty acids, which are long carboxylic acids, to produce, you guessed it, an ester and water. So what is saponification? Well, it's the making of soap involving the reaction of a triglyceride with a strong base such as sodium hydroxide. The triglyceride, which is your ester, ionizes in the presence of sodium hydroxide and high heat. Take a look. Sterate ions take electrons in the bond, giving it a negative charge, and the alcohol takes on a positive charge. The sodium ions bond to the sterate ions, and the alcohol bonds to the hydroxides. The actual soap molecule is this one, sodium stearate. Originally, glycerol was left in the soap because it soothes the skin, but nowadays it's more profitable to sell it for manufacturing of pharmaceuticals and cosmetics.